I'm going to actually do something a little different with this coaching. <clears throat> I kind of want to take some of the more nuanced stuff that I haven't really explained uh, mechanically. I really want to dive into what makes uh, someone's laning really good. And I'm going to try to make this particular client um, pretty good at laning. He's bronze, so this might be this might be a work. This might be a challenge. Yeah. Did like we accidentally IQ, did we accidentally uh, take armor? That's not good. I mean, it's not the end of the world. But uh, hold tab real quick. Oh, yeah. It may not be that big a deal. Oh, it's kind of a big deal because it's tri triple AP. So as a rule, <laughs> as a rule, yeah. I say uh, we should always check if we're facing a top lane and we're facing a jungle matchup. Um, think about what matchup is going to impact you the most and then ruin appropriately. Because sometimes even though you're, you know, even yeah, though you took the wrong thing. AP. Right. Even though you took the wrong runes, like sometimes you might have like a jungle matchup where it's like, ah, I got armor. This is okay. It's not that bad. Right. If I get ganked, I'm going to have silence. a little bit more. Yeah. It's not, it's, it's not a great position to be in, but we we're, we're allowing. We'll be all right. Um, I like, I usually like to let them push in, but we'll see. So go ahead and he's not on the way. So I'm going to start autoing just like once and see what he does. Okay. He's not guarding the wave at all. So yeah, it's, it's newbie time. And for now, I'm just chilling with the guy. And when we try to queue, exactly. Nice little auto sneak in there. That's good. That's good. The trade was not bad. Yeah, I got my corrupting pot off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, he's pushing the wave. This is kind of expected. All right. This is what we figured would happen. He's going to he's gonna beat our ass early. But once we have level three, it gets a lot easier. Yeah. I can do my full combo. Right. So we'll just back up. And Nocturne's doing his clear. So we can think about the jungler right now, Silas. I don't think Silas is going to invade Nocturne or anything. That's always something you could think about while you're chilling and waiting for the wave to crash. Is like, am I going to have to rotate to the sky? Yeah. But at the moment, there's no there's no big deal here. Yeah, Silas is, Silas is setting up something mid. All right, we're getting way, way too close. That E could have knocked us out of lane there, so be very, very careful. You're on defense, my friend, defense. Now, no, no. let's try to land this E. Cool. So he's going to have to fight on it or give it. And at this point, you've now established the push, right? That's that's the push in our favor. So I would start Wing the wave quickly. Yep. I want to swing this push in my favor. This is perfect. Good. Now, if you can land another E, that would be lovely. Good. We mind read this guy here with that with that E. Yep. Now, <clears throat> remember with Alawi, we're going to be maxing... In this particular game, we're going to be maxing... Well, we, the E max is fine, but you could have maxed Q here. Oh, okay. He's going to take a lot of poke. Because he's melee. I don't think I've ever went to Q, uh, Q max first. Yeah, it's, it, either or is good. Um, in this one though, because he's gonna have to walk up to farm and to fight the clone a lot, you're guaranteed to hit Qs often. Oh, right? He's not gonna have an, He's not gonna be able to dodge them very easily. So I walk up and try to land an E here to poke him down. Just step over the wave and look for. Uh, he's keeping his distance. He knows who's the master of this lane. Right. <laughs> I would keep walking forward, though. It's fine. That's fine. You have another corrupted pot. Now you need a hard push. Really look to, like, get this guy under tower. And if we can land an E here while he goes to farm cannon or something, that would be, that would be the move. So I would look at that cannon closely. Think about how he's going to try to snipe it. Great. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. All right, I take a recall here. This is a really good time to recall. Yeah. 800 gold, yeah. Right, it's a really good time to do can, it. I can get a uh, null magic to kind of counteract the rune I didn't get. No, fuck that. We're not doing that. We're gonna just go right. straight into a sheen. Sheen? Yeah, grab a sheen and TP forward to the tower. All right. You don't wanna, you don't wanna let this guy take a break. 
He's really low under tower. Okay, you can see Silas, right? Look where he's going yep. there. So we now would ward the try just to make sure that we can get a little visibility on what he's doing. And we want to get right up on the wave and Q shove quickly. Try to uh, shove at him and Q, the, Q as many minions as you can. And he might be back. You need to, okay. As long as we don't like let him back because we really, 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 yeah, we want this fight. We want this fight. We're very happy with this. Yep. Yeah, easy money. So now we're just going to shove, shove, shove. Now use your corrupting pot and let's find another E. Yeah. Good. I can't go near tower now. You're all right. You're all right. We just hover. It's fine. He has ult still, so it's kind of like... If he gets confident, he might be able to actually go in on us. So fun fact about grasp that a lot of people don't know. You can actually get the grasp off of the uh, clone. Fun fact. I don't want to push this wave in the back. Uh, we're taking one demolish stack because we took grasp. Okay. That's another thing. We get demolished, which is really high value on her. So punch this once and bail. Just leave. Yeah, now you take your recall. So this guy's going to TP forward. We know that. Um, yeah. I don't want to stay out with, with 900 gold, though, and get ulted or something. I don't want to risk that. So we're just going to take the recall, get the Kendall gem, and we're going to stay up this dude's ass. No homo. We'll go back to top. <laughs> don't ask, don't tell, right? Yeah. Oh, wait. No, they got rid of that. They got rid of that. <laughs> but we're basically, we're just going to, I mean, we're going to perma be on this guy. Like, we're never, ever, 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 ever. Now that they failed their gank, right? We're just, you. and by the way, you're doing a really good job of like pressuring, finding ease. Pretty much hit like every E in this lane, which is the gold mine scenario for Alawi, right? Yeah, I've been hardcore, like, learning her because, like, I think it was, like, three weeks ago you said something about some easy champs to learn top. Oh, yeah. And Alawi was one of them. I was like, I really liked Alawi when she came out, like, seven years ago. Let me try picking her up again. She's <laughs> very, very good for this reason because we can just barrel on towers and get ourselves wins and kind of be in charge. We're going we're gonna to just keep jamming this wave. Back up, get ready to E ult if he ults. Go ahead and use your corrupting pot. That's good. Oh, he's not gonna ult you right away. The fuck was that? Alright, just run down to the bottom. The bottom of the circle. Yep. Yeah, you're fine. Should still win. We're pretty far ahead, so. What was that shield? Yeah, it's a big Good shield. Lord. So what you want to do, so in that situation, you ulted. I, I don't want you ever opening ult unless he's ulted himself. Oh, okay. Because that's what kills you there. So like you're, you're, uh, I understand that the Mordekaiser is like kind of on you and pressuring you. You feel like you have to, but I would rather you just walk it out and just wait. Even if you take a bad trade, because as long as you have your, your E and your ult, right? You're in yeah, charge. You can't kill me. Right. He can't. Like, he's going to have to ult you. And at that point, you E ult, then you win. This is good news for us. So, Mord's rotating, but he doesn't have ult. So, I would go to try and stop him if he tries to go back to tower. So, go ahead and hit that plant. Okay, we push now. He's too deep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just shove. Okay. We shove and take a demolish stack. We're just going to jam, jam. Uh, so it's, uh, I got minion blocked. <laughs> yeah, it happens a lot nowadays. Just one or two? Yeah, I would take one for now. We have Nocturne. We're, walk forward, walk forward, walk forward. See if you can fight him. Assist ping Nocturne, like straight behind the tower. Like go behind the tower, straight line. Watch this. Walk straight up. Watch, yeah, straight up. Assist ping Nocturne a bunch and get ready to fight right here. Okay. We can go back around. I don't know where Mordekaiser is. Go down and around the jungle, though. I don't want to get stuck in between tower anymore. I, Mordekaiser should, like, be there. Maybe he just fucking rage quit or something. 
He's done. His teammates aren't helping him. <laughs> He's mad. Well, in this elo, it's a, it's it's. I've learned over the last what twelve years. You pretty much can see anything in this elo. Right. People get p pissed off about stupid. Okay, stuff. maybe that guy just took forever to buy then, because he should have. He should have already been up here. All right, we can go ahead and eat this. Cool. And how much do we need for our item? Because that's kind of where my brain goes in this spot. Okay, so here's the plan. We've got, we've got a plan. So basically, you see this wave that's coming? We're going to shove this wave, try to get a demolish stack, and then We're recall for item. item. Yeah, it should it should time out just so. We have just enough gold. Yeah, walk up. Uh, we need to hit an E first. Yeah, you need to wait. Oh, well, if he get Okay. <laughs> I, I, no, we don't. See, Go ahead and take a recall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He backed down. I mean, that's why I was saying at the beginning. It was like, well, if he doesn't push, then we'll push. But, like, you never know, right? Remember that fucking... The, the free money analogy, right? That's basically that. Yeah. Like, I don't know why he's backing down. He could just walk at you, right? There's no... You can't fight him under tower you there. Think. Right. He could just walk I mean, at you I, there and force, force you to back down. I'm scared kill. Yeah. With the one kill. Hold tab. So every time you're leaving base, we're just thinking about, all right, what's the problems? So we've got this Caitlyn problem, okay? At the moment, yeah. I'm not too worried yet just because our auction is huge. However, if the auction wasn't huge, I would start like fishing for a play on the Caitlyn. But for now, yeah, we're just going to stay up here. Ah, uh, TP or just roam in general. We need to start pushing hard into this guy. We have a completed item, so we got to get him under tower so that we can either kill him under tower or go somewhere else. Yeah. We're on, we're, this is when I always say we're on a timer a bit um, because the Caitlyn's so huge. I just, I don't know if she's going to just start s snowballing the game and taking all the towers. That was interesting. You didn't draw turret aggro there, even though you had Scorch yeah, on. I that was I, very, very interesting. I thought, I, I was like, oh no, I'm about to take another turret shot. He's going to go all in. <laughs> hey, calm. Don't play this ult. No, do not play this ult. Back down. Yeah, walk away. Walk away. Walk away for now. That's good. Like, play it slow. Now you E, and then maybe you can turn here. This guy's an asshole. Yeah. To, was, He's playing it smart. Get... He's playing it smart though. So you got your E and you got flash. I'm fine. You might have set up the auction to revive you. We'll see. Nice. Okay. That's that's what you I want. Let's I... see. We would TP yeah. to. We would. Well, actually, just walk to mid for now. We're not TPing anywhere. Right. Do I need to buy anything to? Uh, buy buy boots. I do buy boots here. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let's go. Boots and, boots and all sorts. Yeah, that's fine. So, uh, maybe TP bottom? No, we can't because there's no... We're not at 14 yet. Well, let's walk down bottom, though. Let's walk down seconds. bottom. We're going to walk down that way. At the very least, we can take second. plates. Well, we don't want to TP second. unless it's a flank, though. We don't want to TP unless it's a flank. Yeah. We can... We can... Uh, we'll just push bot because we don't have ult. I don't want to try to get lucky. Oh, Caitlyn's... Yeah, she's caught. Nice. All right, let's just yeah. shove the... So, Man, the I don't know if you caught it. it. I don't know if you caught what the Mordekaiser did, but he actually played it right. Like, he didn't ult until you ulted. So, we're just going to give that guy credit for having a brain, even though it's low elo, right? Because he, yeah. he held his ult the whole time. Like, he like he walked away, and he just kind of held it, even though they were getting low. So, what we're going to do now is if we see him, we're going to assume he's never going to ult unless we ult, right? So, we're just going to wait. Right. Well, I mean, I, I saw the opportunity to get in a three stack. Right. I was hoping to get, like, right. a quick kill. This is good. Okay, run away with it. <laughs> you get the debuff. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna just keep shoving. Mmm, it's getting dangerous. I'd back down. Now you need to remember this guy is really fed. Hold tap. He's really fed. Oh, yeah, he's five. Mm -hmm. He has a lot of injuries too. So with with and and bonus, we don't have any real like MR at the moment. Um, oh, I would yeah. not. I would. I would not go Merc Treads. I would just treads play. Work? No, I would literally just go for the Kindle oh, Gem and just get pain. more health. Well, it's yeah, it's that, and it's also just like you don't have to walk into Zyra's range ever. Like, do you understand? She can't get to you. 
I was thinking about the tenacity and how much. Uh, right, 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 right. right. But what I, but what I'm saying is that like, in this case, if you're dying to Syrah, right, that just means you're stepping too close for no reason. You can always just turn around and walk backwards. The only way she ever kills you is if she flashes on you. We go top here. We don't want to split with everybody. You best just to TP up. No, I'm walking. I'm walking. Yeah. That's how we have the split push pressure. Right. With that yes. And if they go to if they go to start drag, we can consider it. We need to make sure we're jamming these uh, corrupting pots every time we get low too, because we're kind of having this. Uh, we're kind of dropping a lot of HP. So just calmly walk in, hit an E. Now remember, Mordekaiser will have his ult here. We can just sit back. Yeah, we we'll just wait for the next E. <laughs> that was my my Lux is ult, not. Uh... Yeah. Yeah. Not this is enemies. good. Back down. Don't do not do not ult with this Mordekaiser near you though. Right. If he ults somebody else, okay, now you can do it. Silas OP? No. Silas not OP, not yet. Not on this day. Kind of OP. <laughs> yeah, I got him. <laughs> Nocturne's there. He, he should stayed alive for so long. Oh, I know. Though. Silas is fucking annoying. That W though, his W is just insane. Yeah, our champion's nuts. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get call fields. Cool. Okay, a team, a teammate got it done. So get the call fields, and then if he goes, I I think here, I think I would just go top. Well, I well, I think I would just walk Too to drag. Dead. I would walk to drag to start, um, because top's okay. pushing regardless. Oh, like yeah. it's gonna push There's in. Minion advantage. So you're basically, if you walk all the way up there, you're just going to a funeral, right? Like the wave's going to have to come oh. all the way back out first before you even get anything done. So here, I'm not TPing to this, but I'm just, just going to walk mid and a ram for a bit. Uh, okay, Baron's not up, but I, I want to just go forward, push into the Caitlyn, and then Caitlyn's going to rotate to this fight. You already know she is, so you're going to walk kind of forwards as you clear this. So walk straight line, like like you're moving towards the next wave, because you know where Caitlyn's likely to go. She's going to go down that way and see if she can get something done. There you go. Now, your team just want to fight, so what I would do is I would just back down now, and I would go to like Baron, maybe Ward Baron, uh, and then grab the top wave. All we right. need to get our I'll second item. Back. Yeah, we need to get our second item. We could clear this as well. Like we should get rid of this thing. We don't want to eat it though. Yeah, we don't yeah. want to <laughs> eat it. <laughs> I was like, why did I eat it? Now we'll go top. And how much do we need for Black Cleaver again? Is it 12? Yeah, it's 12. Yeah. So what we can like do here legs. we could we could fight this guy if he's uh squaring up on us yeah if he wants to square up i'd walk at him i'm not i'm not letting him just hang out i walk straight at him there you go always give him a chance to to fight you right if they want to play stupid right if he's if he you know if we walk at him and he thinks that he can win that would be perfect for us okay somebody's TP, like mort's tping somewhere i don't know where but he just tp'd we're gonna hard shove and back down so we get our E. Use these corrupting pots too. Okay, so we E ult then. Yeah, he shouldn't have his ult. Let me ult this. Jam these corrupting pots uh, as well. Yeah. I didn't have any mana. Right, right, right. That's why those corrupting pots though, you gotta you gotta spam that shit as you're moving around. You have to. Okay. Because you're basically taking all these trades. No, 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 no. Let's hold it. What's this Nocturne doing? I want to see. Yeah, yeah. Let's. Okay, so this. He killed Mord. Yeah, we're we're gonna probably just wait for Black Cleaver. Um, even though it's kind of slow, you just need to remind yourself that when you're running Corrupting Pot like this, you gotta just like as soon as you start taking trades randomly, just use all three. It doesn't even matter at this point. Okay. Just make oh, yeah, sure that you're so much right. Just make sure that you're like getting them off. We're gonna wait for Black Cleaver. We're just gonna sit. Right. We don't want to go anywhere. Remember when you had to buy home guards? Oh yeah, for real. <laughs> <laughs> Do they even have the attachment things anymore? No. 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 I would. I would probably. I, right now, what I would probably do is I'd probably go to Baron. I would assist being the fuck out of Baron. Yep. There, you know, you've got you've got wave pressure up top. 
you've got a pretty good comp. You've got a pretty good comp to do it. Um, it's a little risky. Okay, so they have vision, so starting it would be bad. But now that we know that they, right. now that we know that they're grouping up, we can maybe try to find an E. I would play bushes. Don't show yourself. Play bushes. They have they have not seen you yet, so you just want to take your time. We have any way to engage Silas? Not really, but we need to take we need to take Scuttle, and then we need to go grab Top Wave. Scuttle prevents us from ever losing Barons. So go to Top Wave, Top Wave, Top Wave, Top Wave. There you go. Top Wave. Don't let them start it. Or? Yeah, so be very careful with ulting here because he might just get mad. Okay, that's fine. So calmly wait for your E. Spam your Corrupting Paws. Just use all three right now. Just jam them. Just jam all of them. Doesn't matter. There you go. Now you ult the shit and you should be sitting very pretty. Well, of course, this guy... We lose our clone right away. We're still fine. Cool. So we'll find an E and we win this shit. Okay. This is good news. Push mid. Push mid. No, 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 no. He's Silas. It's gonna be too. I killed him anyways. Okay, we can't. We, we can Baron. Assist ping Baron. Assist ping Baron. You've got you've got Nocturne there. Assist ping it. Yeah, oh, the guy's pinging. Wow. I'm sure this is low elo. Nocturne ping and then he's on the way to Baron. Well, I mean, I'm bronze too, so and my MMR is high enough where I've gotten a bunch of silvers in my games too. So is silver when you unlock the ping the ping wheel? Is that yeah, I think I think it is. We need somebody here. We need this misfortune or something. Some more damage. Because I've learned that tentacles don't do much to mobs. Yeah, it's kind of lame that it doesn't. It should do more. To make it Lowy jungle viable. <laughs> that would be ridiculous. That'd be fun. All right, let's back yeah. down. Let's go out towards blue so we don't get caught. Yeah, and just get into really this hard bush to here. Ganks, right. Because with tentacle times, right. it'd be really hard to set up some ganks. So oh, now what you're gonna do is you're gonna you're gonna get Merc Treads, you're gonna TP to mid tower right now. You're not gonna waste any time. Mid tower, there you go. You're gonna go out, we're gonna try to find an EE right away. And just, just we really wanna kind of leverage the fact that we have based and we have a, we've spiked mercs, but we gotta get it. We gotta land an E. Careful, it's a 4v1. It's a 4v1. We'll just sit back. We can't die here. That's good that you're using the corrupting pot, so that's perfect. Just a good way to give yourself added regen and, and uh, skirmishes and whatnot. So we need to push this out. Yeah, we can kill it. We can get this. More should not. Oh, I guess he does have ult already. Damn. We've Yes, that's a good choice, except you flash on the trap. Yeah, I didn't see the trap. Yeah, uh, it's easy to get to lose sight of them, to be honest. All right, this guy's definitely toast. All right, now, <clears throat> Dragon at this point, I believe, is pretty much free. I don't think Silas is just sitting on Dragon and farming it. We're not going to go there, though. We're going to shove mid first. We're going to shove mid first. Okay. Uh, it's already... Well, we're going to take that tower. We're going to take the tower. You still have all... You still have the E. You can take it. You can You can I'll W it. The minion do it. Now we go to Drag. Oh, they got Drag. I'm actually surprised they were on it. But whatever we can if they do that that's good because now we can kill kind of kind of goofy but maybe so <clears throat> remember when you've used the e kind of sit back mm. a bit right until the oh, next e comes it. up right kind of like space back we'll go we'll go uh spirit visage is really good here Night Harvester, Rod, mm -hmm. Jack Show. <laughs> I fucking hate that. I hate that freaking item. Especially like when Rambus has it. It's so annoying. You need everybody to kill him, but nobody can. Uh, you can't get everybody there because of Jack right. Show and it gives him so much armor and everything. Right. So, right now, hold tab. So, we're just checking game state. Biggest problems, you aren't wrong, are pretty much all AP threats right now. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to bottom. I don't want to go near Mordekaiser right now. I'd rather just like let him do his thing. Him taking a side lane tower doesn't mean shit at the moment, right? I'd rather us yeah. just draw pressure and stay away from Mordekaiser. Guy could it, literally just press R on us and waste our time. I'd rather just challenge these guys. 
So like do I swing. go in for the swing? I would go to the wave first. Because if you go around, you're going to get sandwiched. You're going to get sandwiched by Silas. And Silas has pretty big uh, stats too at the moment. Like you hold tab. You should constantly be checking like who's strong. Right. So right now Silas is pretty fucking strong. If you can fight like him and Swain, I think it actually goes okay because of your ult. Yeah, because they can't really stop you right. from doing Healing. anything. Right. They don't have heal reduction, it looks like, either. That's the other thing. I mean, Ignite might be used on you, I guess. Yeah, but Swain would have to have it up. So what I would do here is instead of sieging, I would actually push this in. Oh, now I would just shove. I would, yeah, I would just push because if they fight yeah, mid, mid. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they're... And, and we got top pushing, too. Yeah, this is goofy. You can try to find a quick E and then bail if you if you uh, miss it. Uh, I'd sit back. I don't know where they are now. I'd sit back. Run, 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 run. This is a sit back moment. There you go. Just keep walking away. Spam the corrupting pots. Now you can, like, hover. Just kind of wiggle at them a little bit. Sitting near my two tentacles and just kind of... Yeah, now I would now I would uh just kind of wait for this next wave, crash it, and then maybe we can group for something. He's killing somebody. That's okay. Just push. Wow, he's struggling. We'll push this <laughs> in. This is oh, he's like flashing it on the ground and shit. Let's try whatever. So let's hold tab again. We're just constantly checking. Okay, so I would ping your team off, take a recall, and then start setting up Baron. Ping the timer. Yeah, grab what you can. <clears throat> let's go to top and let's take the uh, the scuttle. All right. Oh, the scuttle here. Yeah, because see, if your team starts dying at this stage, this is why I had you back down. Because if they die right now, it's like really dangerous. Right, it gets it starts getting scary really quick. Now Akshan's getting caught too, so this is kind of what I was afraid of. Well, actually, he's he's the man, I guess. One v one v nine. Yeah, 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 that's fine. What can we do with it now? We should assist Ping Baron, right? It would be a shame to lose with this guy doing that. Yeah, we go to Baron here. We go to Baron here. Silas dead for 15. Now they could obviously get a lucky steal, but it's pretty unlikely right now. Nice try. Should probably DPS here, yeah. Oh my god, they got the 85. What the fuck was that? That's I think it was the knock up. I think it was the knock up. All right, let's go to drag. We go to drag. Is this ping it? Maybe. No, she pushed that up. I guess I can... Can I start it? Yeah, yeah, of course. I'm just going to spam these. Get my health back up. Sit back. Okay, you can walk up now. You can walk up now. Don't get too close. Don't get too close. Oh, I guess your team just fucking stomps anyways. There you go. Someone in chat, healing. someone in chat says, uh, poor keyboard. <laughs> poor keyboard. I think that's an Stand accurate. <laughs> yeah. So what we can do right now because of the heal problem, does anybody on our team have heal reduction here? No, no, they really they don't. Do they, they really do not. Uh, so what you would do is you probably just go thorn mail or something. Does that apply Grievous? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, since they, I thought it was, I thought, so I thought if you hold, okay, damage. so if you hold tab, if you hold tab, since a lot of their champions will wind up autoing you at some point, um, 
uh, right some autos <laughs> i don't think these guys are smart enough to not auto you right like I, I just don't see that happening so what i would do is i would just play for that the bramble then and it's a little bit actually, more functional they... because think about how the fights are actually going you're not going for like executioners and bursting them go ahead and wait wait for the bramble it's worth it okay is it 500 yes because think about it if you go like bramble if they're pounding on you like this and the fights go forever you're getting more value out of it right Whereas like executioners would be more reserved for the uh, situations where you want to like burst somebody down who heals like a big burst of healing, right? Um, that would be more for your like your Vladimir or something who's not going to auto you. Uh, I, I just go bot here and push out, right? Yeah. Well, I, I was the only one that lost though. Baron there. Well. Oh. Almost. Ah, I fucked that up. No. I think Silas, I think Silas is coming for me. Solomon Jungle. Yeah, so what we're going to do is we're going to square up on bottom and start sieging it out. I fucked that up. All right. You're still going to get some damage value out of it. Just keep finding uh well, a siege is better. A siege is better than sitting here. We need to get the waves under tower because it's so hard to siege into them. Oh, that was so close. <laughs> it's not bad. Use the corrupting pots, though. I'm so dead. <laughs> it was a goofy flash, for sure. It was definitely yeah. a goofy. It's a bit of a goober flash. Our more the our team was kind of zoned off by the Mordekaiser, which made things uh, interesting. Yeah, very split fight. Yeah, I guess I did get a decent amount of healing just from brambles. And that one little skirmish. The heal cut, you mean? Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, the healing reduced. Yeah, it's um, it's it's pretty impactful if if the fights get to a point where everybody's getting low or just like rotating through spells over and over again and autoing. Good God! Yeah, this guy is going in. Deleted. Deleted so wait, hold whatever. tab again. Just He's constantly checking the timing. So we'll go and set up Baron again. Yeah. Gotta love these forty-minute low elo games. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's why, that's why I thought a Lowie would be such a good pick because late game, it's so hard to, so hard to deal with a Lowie because you have to work so much around her at low elo. And mm -hmm. A lot of people don't do that much coordination in low elo. So, that's why I like it. So what we're going to do is shove mid, set up Baron, and then hopefully end this, this torture that we're going through right now. This is just another another Friday for me. <laughs> this is my every game. <laughs> so hold tab real quick. Let's move over to Baron. Yeah. So the reason I keep having you hold tab is I'm just constantly checking like what's the team comp look like, like what items people have. I'm looking at things like stopwatches. That Silas has a stopwatch. That you see the Zyra has a stopwatch. Like get it in your head before the fight happens. Like what the fuck are you facing right like what are we going to be up against like if i go all in on that zyra she's probably going to stopwatch so i would poke at her but i wouldn't go too crazy because i wouldn't want to get baited right yeah i would take that plant that gives you shield now yeah okay this is not good news this is not good news but lux is pushing bottom so what we do is they're going to go to baron we need to walk towards baron and we need to try to land at e yeah, we're going to poke a bit. Yeah, if we have to ult, we have to ult, whatever. Kite away from them, though. Run away, yeah, as much as you can. Because you want to waste their time. Then E ult if they keep chasing you.
Now, see, Silas is on Baron this whole time. So what you just did was you really fucked with him here because his team kind of left him hanging. Now, just run to the right and take a recall real quick. Uh, could I get help? No, 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 take a recall. No, 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 no. Take a recall. Just trust me. Recall, recall, recall. B, 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 B. You're throwing here. The reason why I say you really need to recall is because oh. you could get back on the map immediately. So what you could do now is you can... Um, I don't think a TP would work because if you TP to top, they just collapse on you. So it's not, there's not that much value, but I would rather you be back on the map. See with full health than what you were going to do. Just waste time. Uh Oh, that's not good. He landed the biggie. We're going to walk over and bail this guy out. Okay. Okay. We can just hover here, dance around. Now they have Baron. So if we die to these guys, they're going to take a lot of ground back. We should try to challenge this Mordekaiser. He's by himself, and Silas is pretty low. He's probably going to recall. Okay, let's just wait here and pray. I think I think he kills her, though. Yeah, I don't know if this ends well for us. But we could poke at him, though, because we're not just dead to him. Oh, yeah, it's ending better than I thought. Look at that. Hey, you're fine. You reduce a lot of healing. Should be fine. What a stupid meta this is. <laughs> this fucking fight. <laughs> All right, take a recall. Take a recall. Take a recall. The bush in the bush. Oh Here's what God. we're going to do. Here's what we're going to do. You see there's two mid. Caitlyn top. All right. Yep. Right now, we're going to grab the thorn mail. We're going to get back out there. We're not going to TP yet. If they go, if Caitlyn runs down to bot side, we're going to TP to top. Otherwise, we're just going to walk mid. I can solve too. That, that was such a funny battle. That's so stupid. <laughs> I this is like one of those games. Like I told you to go grasp here for the lane pressure, but like obviously Conqueror would be probably doing a little bit more for us right now. But we probably we probably got good grasp uh, stacks though through lane phase. Twenty one hundred. So what we're gonna do is assist ping top and move your team to top. Hold tab again. I want you to see the timing. Look at the timing. It's three and a half minutes. Get your team to top at all costs. So try to assist ping them. And if they ignore you, just push mid. If they ignore you, just push mid. Yeah, yeah, push mid. Push mid confident with Akshan. You got to try to find these kills because they're distracted, right? Now, you should try to push in. I don't... I think you could actually... Mm, I don't think you can end. I don't think you can. But can we can, can, I can. I can get in. Him. We could. We could instead. We we could help Akshan though. Play off of him. Play off of him. Okay, he's dead. Okay, he ulted. If he gets crazy. Okay. Unfortunately, you did not e first. If you did, you probably would have gotten quite a bit done. But you can see, you can't really end there. It's not really. Possible. We don't we don't attack that fast, and I knew Silas would base quick enough. Now, well, you can't really build anything until we have like fucking three thousand gold. Um, no. this is nothing. You see what I mean? We can. Oh yeah, I guess we have the corrupting pot that we could sell. Yeah. Hmm. That's what I was thinking. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe more magic resist because I'm taking twenty six hundred magical damage. Uh, sell the corrupting pot for now. Go, you would actually just go to uh, gargoyle here, is what you're supposed to go to, I think. Gargoyle stone plate, they're just kind of like beating on you. Also, that component is a pretty good buy, yeah, because I get armor and mm -hmm. resist. Stone plate will play pretty well if we get there. Hold tap again, yeah, I'm ahead mm. of him right now. I'd say just push mid and try to end here. Well, yeah. they don't have a they don't have a they don't have a tower. Like you guys can just walk down mid, assist ping mid, and assist ping the nexus and just start pushing. They don't beat you in a straight up fight. Like they don't have a they don't have a tower. You just push a wave. If you land an E, the game's over. Yeah, that's what you're looking for. Just keep walking straight line and try to hit an E. Push the wave, push the wave, push the wave. Okay, that works. That works. You can fight that. You can fight that.
Yeah, they just don't have a wave. They're just <laughs> interesting. <laughs> GG. The Silas was something. It was something, brother. Nice. It's a GG. 5147. <laughs> All right. So oh, this boy. isn't this isn't uh I I don't really like I think outside of your random spamming of abilities and fights, it's just kind of that that I think you could probably work on just trying to maneuver more in those fights instead yeah. of just spat is like spamming abilities like that. But I mean at the same time, at least you're getting damage off. Uh yeah. because like for a lot of people, like they don't even do that. I this wasn't that bad of a game. I think the, the biggest issues that you're having is that you're every time that you'll use an E, you'll just kind of like hover around fights instead of kind of spacing back. 